I don't know how to start a video, but I'm Hootless, and this is Stardew Valley episode 28 of Doing It All. I'm gonna be a little bit quieter this time, I'll try to like mix the audio up in post, but like people are sleeping. I'm over at a friend's house for a few days, so the next few recordings are gonna be done like in the mornings while people are still asleep, and as a result I'm gonna to try to be, you know, a little bit quieter. But, you know, everything's going pretty well. Uh, we managed to get a truffle oil this episode, which is pretty cool. We did, of course, need a truffle oil in order to complete one of the bundles. And now that we have it, although we did have to pay like 5,000 gold for it, we uh, were a little bit closer to getting some of the things done that we needed done. And, you know, are not really capable of doing on our own. Another thing we need to get is a normal truffle, because like somebody pointed out whose name I can't remember, in uh, one of the previous videos, pigs don't go outside during the winter, so uh, to be able to complete this in one year, we have to have the pig done before the end of fall, so that the pig can be grown up in, like, you know, during the opening parts of fall, and going into the end parts of fall, be able to go outside and get a, uh, get a truffle for us. This video is also a little bit short, as you guys may have noticed, I only recorded for like 40 minutes, just to try to keep things brief, but uh, yeah, that's basically that. I don't know how this sounds, hopefully it sounds alright, I have my microphone moved over to be in front of my mouth, unlike off to the side, like it normally is, so ideally it sounds a little bit better at least. And you know, we just uh, we go around and we give people mayonnaise. We continue to not have the ability to make sashimi, because I still haven't gotten around to upgrading my house. Mostly due to a lack of money. I have been looking on occasion for the uh, mushroom cave level thing, and haven't been able to find it so far. I don't know exactly what the spawning requirements are for it, but perhaps I'm just getting really unlucky and haven't been able to find it yet. Ideally, we can find one of those relatively soon. It'd be nice to be able to get our foraging up to like a level 10 and get iridium quality with chance for double harvest every time. And that would yield quite a lot of mushrooms. We'd probably make at least 10,000 gold in a day, if not more, because we can keep going back. Also, at this point, we managed to uh, get another harvest of pumpkins, which gives us a lot of money and also has the added benefit of uh, letting us finish part of the quality crops bundle. Now we have five pumpkins, so, you know, we're significantly closer. We just need to get five gold star corn. And that should come soon-ish. I do have like eight corn crops, which isn't much, but they s one of them seems to produce a gold star corn every time, maybe? I'm not really sure how that works, but Hopefully we'll actually manage to get all of the gold star corn that we need, and then we can finish the quality crops bundle, which will bring us one step closer to finishing the pantry, I think it is. Yeah, the crafts room is the other one. Also, I have no idea what was going on at this point in the video. I just went into like some kind of mystical dream world or something. I've never really gotten the hard events with anybody except for Leia, so... There's a lot of things that I haven't seen and throughout this series, you know, I'm raising social levels with people, so I'm starting to see, like, all these extra events and such. Just, you know, various cutscenes that I've never seen before. I assume everybody has, like, a few cutscenes, and probably, you know, most people don't have as many as the various bachelors and bachelorettes, but... I'm sure everybody has at least one cutscene that they do, just to keep things fair and balanced. So, uh, you know, we make our final rounds, giving mayonnaise to the people, and I think I managed to actually give two gifts to everybody this week, without, you know, missing out on anything, other than, you know, the people who don't like mayonnaise. But that's their fault for not liking mayonnaise, I suppose. If only they liked it, we could give them a gift as well. But, oh no, you know what, I miss uh, Rasmodius and Harvey, I think. 
Harvey because he never shows up anywhere. Resmodius because he's so far away. But uh, anyways, hope you guys are all enjoying this series. If you are, remember to leave a like, leave a comment, maybe subscribe. Helps out a whole bunch, and I'll see you guys all next time.